This is the part of America where people think that you can do a burnout in a Subaru, you guys. I just want to point that out. Um. There it is! We are currently getting prepared and getting ready to go on the actual gumball itself. We have actual RFID cards this year, so that's pretty sick. So this is pretty insane. So we've got things, we've got cars like from a Lotus to a Mustang to a GT350 to a wide body BRZ to GTRs to twin turbo Vipers. It is going to be absolutely insane. We're about to do our driver's meeting and then we're going to head off. Pretty much all day is just going to be absolutely insane. So we're going to do the driver's meeting and then we're going to start driving. All right, so we just had our driver's meeting and we're leaving in 10 minutes. So I'm gonna go ahead and get my car warmed up. <laughs> Let's go, dude. I'm so excited. Gotta warm up because Forrest internal life. It's time to go. Oh man, GTR, Lotus. Eighth, are you ready? Ah! <laughs> yep. So we are here at the Celebrity Car Museum. I'm gonna keep my car running so that my everything can kind of cool down. Oh, that's hot. I, I, I guess I kind of just took a wrong turn. I was pretty far ahead of the pack and then something happened and then I just, I don't know. But I'm like one of the last people here. If you guys don't know what this is, I shame you. Oh my God, they have, that, that's the eclipse from Fast and Furious. No way. We have over 30,000. That is sick. Look at all these Hot Wheels. Also, evidently, there were uh, cops here like 30 minutes ago trying to like arrest people, like us. So, that's fun. This is actually Paul Walker's car. This is his personal 370Z. It has like 700 miles on it. Like, this, this is Paul Walker's car. So they actually have 93 up here. We're in Branson, Missouri. We're about to head out to our second checkpoint. We're gonna be doing some more pretty aggressive driving and then we're going to be going to Little Rock. So it's gonna be a lot of driving and a lot of fun. And uh, yeah, so I've gotta make sure that I'm completely filled up and ready to go because it's gonna be a long drive. And also, the closer for last night's vlog, I taped this up. I was kinda of worried that this would melt because it's painter's tape, but it's holding up just fine. And my car is not uh, losing coolant, so it's nice. All right, heading out. We're taking the really long way down, and it's gonna be awesome. Go. Let's go! So we are approaching our second checkpoint right now. 
We don't exactly know where it is. All we're told is that it is in the middle of this town that is literally in the middle of Arkansas. We've got a bunch of gumballers behind us. It looks like we're pretty far up the pack this time, which is kind of nice. There we go. They are right over there. So we're gonna loop around and then we're gonna get this done. So what I'm gonna do is we're gonna, they're gonna scan our RFID tags and we're going to continue to haul butt to Little Rock, Arkansas. Make a good stop. Let's go! <laughs> so I saved you guys a little bit of time. We are in Little Rock. We made it. We actually made it pretty quickly considering we took a back road. My butt hurts so badly, like I want to just get out of this car. Are we like the first people here? We're actually one of the first people here. No way. What up? What up, Rob Card, you're second. A second? Yeah, one more time. Beach. What? Oh. We are back at the hotel. Your boy got second. I had no idea. I guess it's probably because I just didn't fill up on gas. I'm at like an eighth of a tank right now, so I literally feel so nice to stand up. Oh, and the key card is RFID. Daddy's home. Look at this. I'm just living it right now. Check this out. Look at this view of this nasty little industrial lake I got right here and this nice, cool little rooftop. What is this? A oh my God, look at this couch. See, this is why doing rallies like this are cool because, you know, not only is it a crazy fun experience, but it's nice, like you get nice stuff. So a few hours have passed. I'm actually changed right now. Uh, we all went out, we kind of just had dinner. I literally just waited two hours to get chicken strips and fries at a restaurant, so that was kind of annoying. And get this, I've eaten a banana. Well, aside from what I ate for dinner, I've eaten a banana and a sandwich today. So it was pretty terrible. I it was it's it's 10:45 right now and I have to finish editing this vlog and I got to finish doing all this kind of stuff before I go to bed. But anyways, dinner was amazing because of you guys. I'll tell you why. Because while I was at dinner, the Shank Squad hit 100,000 subscribers. We did a live count while I was at dinner, and uh, it was awesome. You know, I had a bunch of guys. There's like, you know, 30 guys out there at the table with me, and it was just, it was really cool um, just being able to celebrate that because I've waited a long time for this to happen, and I'm just, I'm so thankful for that. So I know you guys, some of you guys always give me a hard time because I say thank you too much or whatever, but I could care less. One of the biggest things for me in life is it's important to be thankful in the good times and especially in the bad times, but no matter what, I want to be remembered as the person who was thankful. So seriously, anyways, thank you guys so incredibly much. I, 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 gotta, I gotta finish this vlog. I've only done like, I've only edited for like an hour today and I probably have another hour. So I'm gonna try and go to bed before like two because I gotta wake up at like seven. So anyways, I gotta get this done. Thank you guys so incredibly much for watching. I hope you guys are enjoying the daily vlogs. I will see you guys next video or ne tomorrow with airstrip footage. That's right, airstrip. Peace out, and I will see you tomorrow. Uh, 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 uh.